just setting off this morning from our lovely mooring spot. It turned out to be a really good one for a good night's sleep. Feeling refreshed, ready to take on the next 10 locks. I don't know if there are 10, but I'm pumping myself up just to get ready and stuck in. It's been a while, folks. And if you're new to the channel, or you've been here all along, we're Mel and Paul, and we live on this here boat. Definitely looking pretty wintry around here. A little bit dull, a little bit gloomy, and definitely cooler than what you're about to see. Now is as good a time as any to relive the summer. We're quite sporadic in posting our videos. Life sometimes takes over and gets the better of us, and so our hobby of posting YouTube videos sometimes takes a back seat. But we've got loads of footage from our summer cruising. So let's get back into where we left off. A little bit of a rainy day, not so summery, but some good weather views on the horizon. A lock flight of 10 or 11 I think. We've heard there are volunteers at the top lock so that'll be a nice little convenience, little easy finish to the flight. The rain's holding off, it's just sort of spitting so we can deal and met some lovely people already so set to be an enjoyable flight. The rain suit back on. Yeah. The rain oh, suit yeah. back on. I'm gonna get mine. I think it's time, just in case. Might be soaked by the end of 10 locks.
that after bed. Easy peasy. Was for me. I don't know about you. Harley right, the Atherston lock flat. Not too bad at all. Uh, 11 locks in total. But when you've got boats going in either direction and Canal and River Trust volunteers to help, it's a pretty easy go. It's past midday. We're heading on to about two o'clock. Definitely time for lunch. available to purchase on the towpath. Even alpacas in the market for an alpaca. Oh, it's the wool, isn't it? They sell alpacas and the wool. Oh. You can buy a whole alpaca or just the wool. The choice is yours. <laughs> if anyone's ever taken an alpaca on a boat, let us know. <laughs> Although some people's dogs are the size of alpacas, let's be honest. Coventry Canal was pretty good earlier, but as we slowly move along it, it keeps showing off for us. Grass is so green. We've been pootling along the Coventry Canal for long enough, so we took the turn just under that bridge behind me and we are now on the Ashby Canal. It's afternoon time, so drinks on the go, crisps in the bowl, ready to enjoy what the Ashby has to offer. a nice easy route the Coventry was fantastic for that aside from the lock flights of 11 locks hardly any other locks on the way and we hear some other things about the Ashby Canal that there aren't any locks so the lovely continuous cruise very chilled out even along the Coventry Canal aside from Nuneaton which we just passed through before we took the turn it's fairly quiet and very enjoyable another quiet night. We're getting earlier and earlier these days, but this is actually turning out to be a bit of a holiday. Hallelujah. We hope you enjoyed spending a day with us out on the canals. We are certainly enjoying reliving our summer in this way. Now is as good a time as any to remind you to hit that notifications bell and definitely subscribe. It's the best way to be notified when our videos are going to be uploaded. As I said right in the beginning, we're quite sporadic in posting them, so this way you'll never miss a beat. See you in the next one. It is shaping up to be a stunning day. Look at the sun, high on the sky. We've just set off from our mooring along the Ashby and we are en route to Trinity Marina. So right.